preaching, Bale. Um, I mean, I stopped preaching early if I could, but seriously, if you don't understand, if you don't understand how close we are to being able to say, as a people, right, which is a righteous, intense thing to think about, that like we are, we are, a, we are a crew, you know, yeah. and that we can say to the other failed crews across the country, you allowed the poison to enter your community, but we put up a fucking barrier. deny people who love each other the right to express that love as they see fit in your house if you want, but not in mine. Everyone will know that we move. People will claim that they're from North Carolina and they will say, the way that people who move to Brooklyn now, then you say, where are you from? And they go, oh, I'm from Brooklyn. And what they mean is they grew up in Lawrence, Kansas, but now they're from Brooklyn, right? <laughs> People will do that with fucking Raleigh, and it will be Austin. So I think we have time for this one. Uh, I'm gonna do it, and you can sing most of it if you want, because you fuck my throat. I wish there was some, it's like often I like to do this one acapella. Um, song about a couple people never should have gotten married. <laughs> All that positive shit I was just now talking about. <laughs> nothing whatsoever to do with this song. <laughs> I don't I don't feel that I have any complaints coming in life. Literally all of my dreams have come true. But I will tell you that if you're me and a couple should come up to you at a bar in South Carolina where you're playing and there's no dressing room, so you're hanging out at the trivia machine at the bar, waiting to play your set, and they come up and they say, Hi! We're the Alpha Couple! <laughs> you gotta figure out a way to tell those people, I only look like that guy. <laughs> We're not actually, the Mountain Goats aren't actually playing here, they've moved their show <laughs> to, uh, to Columbia. It's a couple hundred miles from here. <laughs> this is a song about people who need a divorce and they can't seem to get it. It's tragic. But not as tragic as living near them. <laughs> but our few remaining friends, they are the ones trying to save us. 